this is the rear vent here. This thing is neat. This is just a passive vent. And that way we don't have to have any vent windows or any other holes in the van. So we're keeping this thing incognito. So we just put putty tape under the plastic flange and now we're going to put four screws in the corner. I don't know if these are going to be long enough landing. Uh -huh. I'm going to come back and put some longer screws in. So we got a little 14 by 14 wooden frame under there. Just put all the screws in. He's trimming off the putty tape. Putty tape. And we've used butyl putty tape underneath this for, uh, it sticks a little bit better than plain putty tape. Sometimes you gotta take a break from van building and feed donkeys. It's important. And donkeys love garlic bread, if you didn't know. You want some garlic bread there, bud? Oh, not a big fan of garlic, huh? Uh, I think I know someone who does. Mr. Charger, can I feed? Hey, hey, can I feed you a piece? Okay, see the dog is like it. What's your problem? All right, we're doing the second vent at the back of the van. Oh, ouch. Uh -oh. It gets a little hot though. <laughs> It's putty time. Are you guys ready to potty? All right, bad, bad jokes. Those are dad jokes. Dad jokes. <laughs> bad dad jokes. What a beauty. Okay. So these are just two by twos in a square. You getting shots of my guns holding this wood up? No, just your hands, baby. Oh, man. All right. We got the cock, the sealer, the die core around both holes. Keith, show me that. What you're using there. And it's a self-leveling. And where do you get that? You can get it from uh, any RV center. You can get it from Camping World. All right. Online, you can even get it through Amazon. 
Dicor products. All right, here's the final product. Well, almost final product. We still have to put the inside on once the ceiling's done. Why don't you give that a little crank there, sugar babe? All right. Very neat. So yeah, there it is. Here's the inside. Like I said, we still gotta put the ceiling in and we'll put the final shrouding in. Here's the back one. And this thing is pretty cool. It's got this contraption to make sure that the rain doesn't get in. And then here's the inside vent that will go on later. And then it just kicks open like that. But pretty cool, some progress made. We'll check back in.